Introducing MakeBlock AirBlock, the modular and programmable drone. So we bought this for our school for just under 1,400 Hong Kong dollars, including the delivery charge. This is what the front of the box looks like. So let's open it up and uh, take a look, shall we? So let's pick this up. AirBlock on the side. You can see a picture of a hovercraft car. With the AirBlock kit, you can make a vehicle that goes on air, sea, and land. You've got the drone on the top left corner. On the top right, you've got the hovercraft car, and you can clearly see all the different types of modules that you can get. And uh, they are detachable and magnetic, which we'll get into pretty shortly. All right, let's remove the tape. So just get the tape off so we can get inside the box. And then we're gonna open the top. And this is what you get. You can see all the components of the air block, six modular components or seven more like. So let's take a look. We have six power modules. Three of them are red propellers and the other three are black propellers. And they have these magnetic connectors, which you'll see how they work in just a moment. We're going to take them all out and just assemble them on the table as shown. So let's take these out. This is called the main control module and this is the heart of the air block. And the, there is a, a bit in the middle which we insert the battery. So we do have a rechargeable battery, which we'll show you in a moment. Let's put everything there, okay. So if we take a look again at this main control module, we have these plug-in sockets that are magnetic and they will take respective power modules. Certain colors will go into certain plug-in sockets. If you try to plug it in the wrong socket, it will repel with the magnet and you can put it in uh, sideways or at a certain angle, all right, as shown. Right, if you try to put this black one here, it will repel. Now it will stick on that one. Yes, okay. Right, you can see it goes in a certain pattern. Right, and that is what the drone... Oh, it just fell off. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Again, as I've emphasized before, you can put these power modules into different arrangements. What you can do is uh, just experiment a little bit and see what they do. See how the different types of angles affect the air block. Not that I've tried it yet, but you can just play around with it and uh, just see what works best. Let's also have a look at what's inside the rest of the box. So let's remove this top part. There's a big black envelope here, which has some other important bits of information and so forth. So let's open it. So we've got a couple of instruction guides. We have uh, an extension guide also with other peripherals. Uh, I think this is like a warranty card or some, something or other. Uh, these are decals that you can stick onto your air block, which makes it look very nice. And these are some other decal stickers. I think that's for the hovercraft as well. And that's everything inside the envelope. And this is the instruction guide. So, or user manual. Everything that you need to know is all in there. The different types of air block models you can build, the, where the components have to go, and so forth. Pretty straightforward, pretty standard. And that is the instruction guide or the user manual. So digging deeper into the box, we have the USB charging cable, micro USB charging cable. Uh, we'll put that down. We also have a charger, which plugs into the USB charging cable. So that's for charging the battery. And these are some spare propellers. In case the uh, previous propellers break, we do have some spare. We also have these protective covers for the propellers. We have a whole load of those. All right, uh, this is the battery that goes into the compartment of the main control module. So that's the battery. And in the middle, 
we've got the hovercraft base which is this thing here so this will allow your uh, air block to uh, go on sea or water or land and we'll just put that down so let's start to plug this all up so we'll take the main control module we're gonna plug the battery in so just make sure you put it in the right way, make sure the contact points are on the right way and you'll see the light actually flashing like that. This will also tell you if it's, on, if it's low on battery. Uh, let's put the power modules in. So we're going to stick all the power modules on. As shown. Great. Now we're going to use the MakeBlock app. So I've got my iPad here, so there's MakeBlock. And I'd like to connect my iPad to the AirBlock. So right now it's in MBOT mode. So I'm going to choose the AirBlock, right, right there. I'm also going to connect it using the Bluetooth module and uh, it's saying that it's going to update the firmware. So let's just give that some time to update. And once the firmware has updated, we're ready to give this thing a go. So, press the play button. We're going to use the air mode, so choose the air mode. We're going to switch on the air block. And we're going to press the button and let's see how well this thing flies. Oh, yes. Well, it looks like I messed that up, and uh, the reason why I messed it up is because some of these power modules are actually the wrong way round. Right? These uh, foot pads should be uh, facing the ground, and some of them clearly weren't. Now, that is how you do it. That's how it should be. You can see the foot pads. Oh, it's come off. Okay, it's alright. I'll stick that back on. We'll give that another try. <laughs> so as you saw from before, the power modules broke away from the main control module as the air block hit the wall, which uh, is a normal design of this uh, air block. It's supposed to do that. So let's give this another try. Now let's press the off button and see what happens. And as a bonus, we took the power modules and the hovercraft base and made a hovercraft car. So this is the car. We had to rearrange the modules slightly and it's very cool. And that's pretty much all we're going to show with the uh, air block. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you all soon. Thank you and goodbye.